Good morning, friends, and happy Wednesday. I am currently waiting for Brian to get back from his office so we can leave. It is about a quarter to nine, and we said we were gonna be leaving at nine o'clock. Looks like we're not going to be. Um, <laughs> I was hoping to be on the road by nine. It's not happening. Um, he has to be at this company at like 12.30, so, um, which, is gonna be pushing it for us, kinda. Um, like, we gotta leave, like, soon. So, anyway, he had to go to his office this morning um, and get some paperwork done or something. I don't know. Um, but, so, I'm ready to go. The car is packed up. I've got my clothes and everything that I need for my mom's house for the next two days. Um, and then, of course, Brian has his stuff that he needs for his work-related things that he's doing. So, it's all good. Um, I hate leaving my house because I have quite a mess back there. You can see I have like tissue paper, I have a lid, I have toads. I hate leaving my house like this, but I, I know that I'll be back on Friday, so it's not like, it's not like I'm gonna be gone forever. Um, I just hate leaving stuff in a mess. Um, but everything else is cleaned up. Like I've made it my bed, my room is clean, bathroom's clean, kitchen's clean. I just, I'm transitioning, so I have a lot of things out. Uh, but yeah, so I just wanted to go ahead and get the vlog started. We are um, going to be leaving here very soon. So I will see you guys once we arrive. Oh, you know what? Before I before I do that, let me show you guys something really quick. Hold on. Alrighty, so I did pull out my navy blue and white um, checkered pillows and I put my black and white ones there. Um, I think that this room, my dining room, is going to be where I showcase all of the black and white checkered print. I absolutely love it. Um, I actually put some like spooky black flowers up in here. I got these at Michael's a few weeks back. I think this looks really great in here. I'm gonna switch those out probably with like big um, black um, like viney looking, not viney looking things, like sticks almost, but I'll know what they are when I see them. And if I can't find black, then I'll spray paint them black. Um, but I did, you know, put some pumpkins in here. I put some pumpkins there. I laid out some of my black and white bowls that I got from TJ Maxx. Um, one there with a little plant inside of it. And then I put some pumpkins there. Got that pumpkin. I think this was a Target pumpkin, if I'm not mistaken. I think that was a Target pump. Nope, TJ Maxx pumpkin, $4.99. And then the other bowl that matches these other ones are there. And then I put black and white back there. And then a pumpkin there. I actually put the fresh baked pies up there for now. I'm not sure if that's where I'm gonna leave it. And then I added a pumpkin up there. And then of course you guys know that I've had my garland um, hanging here for quite some time because I love this garland. And then I added the flowers on this side as well. So that, um, and then like I said, I'm gonna change those out and then my black and white pillow. But I do have, um, you know, some candles out here. I have some extra pumpkins that I need to set out. Some pumpkins there, pumpkin there, black and white napkin, black and white table runners. So I am working on stuff. It's just, I've had to put it on hold right now. So, because we're leaving. So hopefully, like this weekend, Brian will pull out the rest of my um, Halloween uh, bins, which are up in the man cave. And then next week, I'll start getting more of my stuff out and organized. This camera keeps like focusing on things behind me and it doesn't focus on in front of, like focus on my face. It was just supposed to focus on my face. So next week I'll be doing that. Plus I'll be doing laundry and packing in my normal everyday things that I do every single day. But uh, yeah, so hang out with me this week. I'm going to be vlogging as much as I possibly can. Again, going to be respectful for everybody's needs um, and respectful for the fact that I'm actually going to my, going to Tennessee for a funeral. So um, it's a little, you know, it's sad, but good too, because um, I get to see a lot of family that I haven't seen in a very, very, very long time. And in fact, I can't even remember the last time that I actually seen anybody. So like the people that live up in, my cousins that live up in Massachusetts, um, Caitlin, Dale, and Nicholas. So it's been a very long time. So I'm excited to see everybody and spend some time with them tonight and then mourning the loss of their grandfather, which is my uncle. So 
off to Chattanooga and Tennessee we go for our little road trip. Let's go. Alrighty, hey guys, so welcome to Chattanooga. <laughs> we made it. And as soon as we got to Chattanooga, it started pouring down rain. Um, I dropped Brian off at the company that he has to do the demo for. I'm stopping off at Taco Bell really quick to grab a taco um, and some pintos and cheese and um, a drink. And I'm gonna go probably sit back in the parking lot and just kind of wait for him. This is definitely not a very good area in Chattanooga and the nearest like Target and stuff like that is like 12 miles away. Why don't they put me back up on 24 and take me there and I'm like, yeah, you know, no, I don't want to do all that. It's raining and I just don't feel like it. So I'm going to grab some lunch and then go park back in the parking lot where he's at and just kind of wait for him. So I'm going to get my lunch now. Hold on, please. Hello. So I made it to my mother's and my mom is mowing. My dad is blowing and Brian just left to head to his job where he has to go. So I'm actually going to go outside for just a few minutes and watch my dad do the grass blowing and my mom doing some mowing and I've got some water here and I'm gonna go outside and watch my family. My mom's house is okay. I don't know how long they've lived here. They've lived here for 20, 20 some years or so. Oh, she's so cute. She loves her stuff. I was gonna show you guys this really quick. She just did, her, she just got this bathroom redone and um you know how you guys sorry um how i have the signs on my bathroom um that's where i got the idea my mom had hers on here too but she just got this bathroom um redone so it looks really pretty um she kind of did like the beachy theme as well so she has some of the beachy stuff in here and then the shower curtain and stuff she did a good job well she had it higher done but she did a a good job picking everything out so this is really nice yeah really pretty so now I'm gonna go outside and watch them so we are headed out to meet my aunt and uncle for dinner at the local steakhouse here um, I'm gonna ride with my mom um, because they're driving separately because my mom is gonna go to the wake for a little bit and then she's gonna leave and go to church and then um, I'm gonna ride back with my dad. So they're gonna drive separately, but we're meeting my aunt and uncle right now at the steakhouse for dinner. And, oh, I love this. What? Okay, I will be taking this. Ooh, look at this croc. This is pretty. Ooh, I like that croc. You never know what you're gonna find in my mother's garage. She's got all kinds of stuff stashed away stuff stashed away in here and look i don't understand what's with the egg cartons what what is with the egg cartons is this something like like older people do is collect things like she has a hat in here with hay bales she's got two hoses two chairs egg cartons oh god of course yikes Ooh, i want that sled Hello. <laughs> like I'm seeing stuff that I'm gonna take home with me now. Uh, mother, can I have that sled? I want that light too. Why doesn't she have that out? I might have to talk to her. And then the boys' bikes, there's one missing. Um, where's the boys' bikes? There was four of them. I'm here, Mom. Good morning, friends, and happy Thursday. I am sitting on the front porch at my mom and dad's house. It is really early, actually. It's about, it's a quarter to seven here. Oh, and my mom, she just opened up the blinds. That's so funny. So, <clears throat> so anyway, it's about quarter to seven here, and I just uh, took a shower. I got my makeup on. The funeral is at 10 a.m. So, um, yeah, I just know I wouldn't need to get myself um, ready early because we probably have to leave about 9.30. I um, left my iPhone charger in my car, and Brian has my car. 
Um, and I'm probably down to about 30, oh, 29%. And so I asked my dad if he could just stop up at Walmart really quick on his way home and pick me up an iPhone charger. So he's going to try to do that. I told him if it's under, if it's over $10, don't worry about it because I can wait. But I wanted to charge my phone because I want to take pictures after the funeral of all of my cousins and stuff. So, um, but yeah, that's about it. So today's funeral day and then Brian will be back home this evening or here this evening and then we'll stay here this evening and then we'll drive home tomorrow um, morning sometime. But yeah, so today is funeral day, and uh, I don't know what we're going to be doing besides going to the funeral. Um, and I know it's up on the mountain, so if there's anything there up on the mountain, like I know that's where my grandmother was, my grandmother was born up there, and if my dad could show me, I don't, I know the house isn't still there, but I think there's like a stump or something there, I don't know. Anyway, I'm just outside right now enjoying the morning before everything gets crazy and hectic and before I have to go dry my hair but I think I'm gonna go have some breakfast see if my mom will make me an egg so my mom was hiding these so my dad wouldn't find them and so she's popped some in the toaster for us and this is what we're gonna have this morning Alrighty, so this is what I'm wearing to the funeral because my other black and white shirt was a little too tight in my arms and so I gave it to my mom and she's not sure if she can wear it so I'm going to give it to my sister. But this is what I'm wearing, this little pretty shirt with my black skirt so it's really pretty and my dad brought me a cord so we are off to the funeral and then we'll be back here. Uh, my mom and I have to go to Walmart and get some groceries so she can make, she's gonna make chicken fried rice tonight and egg rolls. So that's gonna be great. <laughs> Her car's so big. It's a boat. She literally drives a boat. Um, but here comes my mom. She's probably not gonna be very comfortable to be on the camera. But anyway, we're off. So disrespectful. Of course, in Missouri, we don't do this because of the, it's too fragile. I know. No, it's a southern thing. Yeah, it is. And that's where we go to the set church there. That's mm -hmm. where Uncle Lloyd and all of them are buried. Grandma's older brother. Oh, okay. And Aunt Minnie. Oh, you know, I didn't know that. They're back there. We can stop there. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. yeah. They got a picture of him on their cemetery. Oh, nice. He's a very cute man. Oh. And who's yeah, there's Aunt Minnie. Oh yeah, Aunt Jen. Aunt Dot's back. Oh yeah, Aunt Dot, Aunt Jen's. Oh, yeah. I remember playing there too. Yeah. As a kid, yeah. hating Daddy at the time because we had to sit there forever and talk and talk and talk. But see, now I'm grateful for those times yeah. well, exactly. <laughs> because I got to know Aunt Jen and I got yeah. to know Uncle Dude and yeah. Dot. And yeah. So those are things I'm thankful for. Tom, at that time, I hated it. Tom. Yeah. Because he had like a pilot or something. Yeah. yeah. And again, at that time, I was just like, come on, Dad, let's go. <laughs> and there was big June bugs flying all over the place. I was like, God, please. But uh, now they're memories. I'm th yeah, absolutely. I'm thankful for those stupid June bugs. <laughs> thankful for those times we had to sit there in the dark. <laughs> I actually was, I, did, I fell asleep one time. I think I was with, when I came with Daddy that time by myself. I just wish you guys would have had more memories of my family. I know. I have good me I have memories. Look, even the trucker respected it and slowed down. Yeah. That's so nice. Even coming down a hill, he had to slow down. I know. Um, yeah. So he's going to be buried up here with Aunt Holly. Yeah. graveyard cleaning is but not at this cemetery right, right? yeah which i'll be up here next saturday the last woods, when me and dad were first when we first came down here mm -hmm. and uh, dad took me on this mountain mm -hmm. it was not paved oh really if i can remember right. so it was gravel it was like a gravel if i i could be wrong it could have just had been paved that but means yes, that you are was. really old Sixty-three years. However, yeah. I'm not really old yet. You're not. However, 
if I keep falling, I'm gonna be old before my time. <laughs> I fall a lot too, so, and I'm 45. Well, I can trip over my own feet. That's just how I am. I just get real klutzy. Klutzy, falling. 